Today's lesson focus on grammar, boys. <clears throat> By the end of this lesson, you will be able to talk about the cause and effects. And also, you will be able to have good knowledge of how to use passive voice, when to use and also how to formulate the passive voice. So, what is cause and effect is? First, let us see one by one and be clear with cause and effect. So, for this, cause is something that makes something else happen. Out of two events, it is event that have been first. To find out the cause, ask the question, why did it happen? Why did it happen? And when we come to the an effect, effect is what happens as a result of the cause of two events. It is the one that happens second or last. To find out the effect, ask the question, what happened? So let us see this example is cause. For instance, the boy kicked the ball and when effect, the ball flow into the goal. The girl teased the cat. The cat stretched her. A red studied hard for the test, and our head came top of the class. Gabriel became a really tired, and the effect is became Gabriel wanted to sleep earlier. Wanted to sleep earlier. At the same connecting words are used to link the cause and the effects. For example, Connecting words are because, so, therefore, leads to result in, in this app, means. And students, I think that is clear. And next, speaking passive voice. What is passive voice? Before we proceed to the passive voice, we need to know what is subject, verbs, and objects. For instance, subjects, a one who does an action. Untainan ashir ka passive ya voice, voice ka guda galen. Wahalo da hai ya, ya mamu hi ma, ina ino kalasaro. Subject ka wahalo da ho, verb ka wahalo da ho, ya object ka wahalo da ho. Passive ki ya active ka say ku kalidu wa yihin, in badan wa hama khashin, wa subject, verb, ya object. Subject ki wa mahi. A one who does an action. What? Samayi, I'm a kubkwa samayi. Verb ki na wa action ki. O fail ki ya. Object is a one who is affected by action of the subject. Ama we called, we call it in another word, agent. For instance, to silence wa kata no, the teacher punished the boy. In this example, the subject is teacher. Of course, we have to say, 
معلنتي مركز سبجكتيو اما قف قوح يالي حنا قنيا معلن ذات اما فعل كنا حنا قنيا بانيش مركز اني معنى اوبجكتيو اما الله يالي هو حنا قنيا ذا بوي سو ذا تيشر بانيش ذا بوي when we write or when we rewrite in active voice it becomes a teacher or the teacher punishes the boys when this sentence is converted to passive voice the object act as subject in the vice verse for instance the boy was punished by the teacher subject boy the teacher and verb is become punished but the object is become teacher whereas in the first sentences the object is the boy and the teacher is the subject and I guess if we take a look other instance or other example the dog bites the man is active voice when we change into the passive voice it becomes the man was beaten by the dogs the man was beaten by the dogs when active voice contains two object the passive voice can be written in two forms such as la baqa ba yanu qori karra marka active voice ku marka ba yanu passive voice ku marka u and wato active wa ba baqa bu hakam da for the For instance, the teacher gave me two books. Maalengo, because he loves the book. Marka Allah lahi. Active voice we yan. Marka active voice kan love subject ya yuleye. Two books were given to me by the teacher. Love kaapa hano kori karra or passive voice. Love das kaabi kaapa ko badi wa kan. Two books were given to me by the teacher. Ayo na kona ya. قاب كلا بعدين وحنا نقول هيا I was given two books by the teachers. Here two books are direct object and the me is indirect object or the two objects. ما بدي object يبقى كه ساسي كلا نقول هيا أو أها object يبقى كه بعدين ولا بدو بوق object يبقى كلا بعدين هو me أو أها أنا كه. So if active voice contains continuous form of the verbs. or verb showing a continuous action then use being with the verb in the passive voice for instance julia is writing a letter julia is writing a letter or we may write that a letter is being written by julia if the active voice is in perfect tense then we use been in the passive voice for instance john has killed a snake and when we rewrite to passive voice it becomes a snake has been killed by john marka mar walba was the bomber saying him or subject ga iyo object ga was the bomber If the active voice is in the future tense, then we use been in the passive voice. To say, for instance, he will have brought some oranges. Because if we can passive for Korean, we can not say oranges. Ki, I'm a some oranges. Ki, object. Ki, ah, mark active. Can you show? I have the not say object. Will have been brought by him. Look. So passive sentences with two objects. Passive ka the bala marbu nakda la bu object. To say, active ka ha. Rita wrote a letter to me. A letter was written to me by Rita. Or we can say that I was written a letter by Rita. Rewriting an active sentences with two object in passive voice means that one of the two objects become the subject and the other one remains an object. 
Which object is to transform into subject depends on what you want to put the focus on. So, students, I hope you get clear, concise, and briefly understand of what you, what we have discussed or what we have learned about the passive voice or active voice. And now we need to have or to look back some voice, some active and the passive voice roles. The object of the verb takes the position of the subject, while the subject of the verb in the active voice becomes the object and is usually preceded by the preposition by. The tense of the verb in the passive voice remains the same as in the active voice. In the passive voice, the third form of the person is yielded. For instance, when we come to the room, present and the finite tense speaking is am or are plus b3. And when, we, when it is a present continuous tense, is am or plus being plus b3. And present perfect tense speaking has, have, been, and plus verb 3. Past in the binary tense is was, where, plus b3. And the past continuous tense was where and being plus b3. Past perfect tense is became had been plus b3. Future in the binary tense is become will or shall plus b plus b3. And the future perfect tense is become will or shall or have or been or v3. How the bar day? Bahamist Marikara, Kap Kaladuan, I'm a structure belay in a big man. Structure cas I will be him or a tense to choke to tense the others. Present in the finite Kumaku Uyai, Holy Skis with Anakonaya is Ama Am R, a v3. Or can you choke a present continuous? Is um, R plus being. Embrace and perfect, I know. So, she may, Sidokale, form ka, I'm a cup ka, I'm a structure ka, Ugarka, I with the lady. So, when we come to the model verbs, model verbs, why not only a model verb, Lagudra B, Blas, B3. Yego hakatan marwalba b be kadana ya model verb is wa marka ay plus b1 ke kadana ya so in the finite in the finite 2 plus v1 and the 2 people as v3 and as i we he she they are changed into term as him her and them so, take care of a singular student. Take care of a singular and plural nature of nouns or pronouns. A verb or helping verb requires to be adjusted accordingly. Interrogative sentences begin with WH words like what, why, when, it's extra. And the question word is retained in the beginning of the sentences. An interrogative sentence in the passive, in the active voice remains the interrogative in the passive forms. An imperative sentence is a sentence showing the order or request. So accordingly, in the passive voice, we say you are requested or order or advice plus infinitive with two. What is the imperative? This can be true. I'm a sentence. I'm a sentence. I'm a sentence. I'm a sentence. Passive voice. I'm a structure. I'm a structure. I'm a 
ادراي كرتون مر والبا محاكم مدها وحد هي كرتا سدن يو ار ريكويستد اوردرد ادفايزد بلس انفينيتيف ويز تو sentences involving elders advice are preferably changed into passive by using the word let or should hadu jumla do ay amar tahay mar badan waxa fi ana ma wanaagsan in a passive marka adu badalaysa in ad deeksato labada eray kala let ama should ad deeksato to sale Save your soul. When you say save your soul, your soul should be saved. Marka should be saved. Aya so kare samesh. Let your soul be saved. Aya the yado kare se do kare o koran kare sa. So let us see further in this sense. Do it. Marka after adam to sali. فهم كيا مقاب كيو غار كا باسيف فويس كما كي نو اديك سني نا ما باستعمال اي سوسيت محسين قري كرا ليت ات بي دان يا بي كريسا محن نودي ليت يو شود ايان اديك سن كرا سي انو بدلو سنتينس كي امو جبلتي باسيف سي انو بدلو اي شود بي دان با يا دو كلنا اديك سن كرتا ان سب سنتينسز ذا سبجكت از انديرستود تايبس هير The subject has to be supplied according to the context while changing them into the active forms. For instance, the thief was arrested. By whom? By the police. Prepositional or prepositional attached with the verbs in the active form continue to be attached with them even in the passive form. For instance, please listen to him. You are requested to listen him. He turned down my proposal. When we change this sentence to passive voice, we may rewrite that my proposal was turned down by him. In the case of a verb having two objects in active voice, either of them can be retained in the passive. For instance, Harry gave me an apple. I was given an apple by Harry. An apple was given to me by Harry. Intransitive verb do not have passive verb. Passive form. For instance, one my intransitive verb. Wahaladaw ama mugdiyasha wahaladaw. Verbs ka anlahin. Passive form ka anlahin. To say, I go to school, go, how can verb go is intransitive verb. Marka go, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to tell you. Marka, I'm going to tell you, the verb is intransitive, I'm going to tell you, 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 I'm going to tell you. So, no passive form. What is then? What is then? If we say, what is then? Cannot be undo. What people do, they cannot undo. Or quasi-passive verbs. For instance, raise, smell is sweet. Actually, you can call it quasi-passive verbs. Like the rose smelt is sweet. Rose is sweet when it's smelt. Or another instance, quining, quining tastes bitter. Quine is bitter when tasted. Lemon is tasted sour, or lemons are sour when tasted. With, with some words, with some verbs, preposition by is not yielded. Like no, surprise, annoy with, containing, vex with, please with, Display, alarm with, line with, and trunk with. So, students, I think you have get deep information about the passive voice 
and how to use passive voice, when to use passive voice, and how to formulate. So now, student, let us do some activities. So change the following activities. Active sentences. Change the following active sentence into the passive. Welcome back, student. Now it is time to do together or to work together. Let us do. For the first question, like this answer. If your answer is the same with this, it is good. You did well. So, Okay, welcome back. That's all for today's lesson. Until next, goodbye.